hello again. How are you doing? Good evening. I'm a bit slightly tipsy, but anyway. Are, are you shell shocked as well? Uh, moderately, because it's one in five, so it's not like a completely out of the blue, but one in five kind of feeling of shell shockedness. Yeah. But, but you, you've got you've got a jury that's so eclectic. They come from all different um, mm. mediums within the film industry, all voting you as, as best director. So how does that feel? Fantastic. I mean, I mean it. It's fantastic. <laughs> can you can you have, have imagined that your journey from when you, you scripted the the screenplay to where you are now, that it would have, have come to this? No, I mean that. I mean that because I think when I wrote it, I was still in the Cotton Varga doldrums. I was just. I couldn't even get a job doing data entry. I mean, I was just absolutely, um, I was in the shit when I wrote that script. So I wasn't even, I didn't even know, I didn't know a single person here. Um, so no, I, I definitely couldn't have imagined that. So the acknowledgement is a, is, a, is, a huge, is a huge achievement for you. Yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah. yeah. And, and, and working as a, as a director, you're, you, you were lucky enough to work with Toby Jones, one of um, highly acclaimed actors. <laughs> mm -hmm. So what was that whole experience like and what do you think he brought out in you as a director? Oh, well, I think he can answer that one, but um, it was good. I mean, I think, you know, because I, I didn't go to film school, so I was I was like a self-taught director, just, just watching films in the cinema. So I've always been a bit, I think with actors, and I, I think I've always been a bit never quite sure how to work with them but I think you know the more you do it the more you learn you know it's just a case of sometimes just listening and just giving them lots of love <laughs> and, um, but it's just learning I think it's, it's ongoing